Stephen, how do you break that game down? Um, disappointing. I think we, we conceded goals in the areas and the times of the game where, you know, it's common knowledge. You don't concede goals at those times. We concede right before half time, right after half time, and then late in the game. So it's not good enough. So yeah, more than disappointed. More than disappointed. It's tough coming out so quick after the game and, and kind of speaking about it. But yeah, there's there's certain scenarios in that game we, we need to be better, regardless of formations and shape and personnel and style, whatever you want to say, there's moments in that game where we need to take responsibility and, and just be a little bit better, but saying that, within the game, we had enough of it, we had enough of it, we should, I should be standing here talking to you about winning the game, at the very, very least, we come away with a draw, from the position we find ourselves in and the, the amount that we had in the second half, we should be, I should be at least talking to you here, with a point, at least, um, so yeah, just, just disappointed Scott. Playing against 10 men can have its own challenges, but we found ourselves 2 0 down. What do you think caused that? Why do you think that happened? Um, the goals we conceded are, are poor. I mean, first contact again for a header. Someone that's not even, he's, he's attacked the ball well, but someone that, that should be picked up, it should be dealt with. Um, you know, the, the set pieces are a big part of it when you're playing against 10 men and dealing with them will put you in a strong position. We've never done that. The scenario we find ourselves in with the, with the second goal, they get in far too cheaply. We've got a 3v2 scenario. Um, comfortable to deal with, like we said, we need to take ownership of that, we need to just be better in those small moments in the game, basic things to concede for there. It's poor, but then but then we had enough, we had enough, we had enough of the ball, we created enough chances, we were positive enough, and product maybe could have been a little bit better, but even within that, sitting here later in the game, you're fully expecting us to at least come away with, with a point, at least, but um, like instead of finding a way to win the game, we've somehow found a way, found a way to lose it. Think when we got that equaliser that we could have went on and got the winner. Absolutely, absolutely. That was the plan. That was the, that was the way it was. It was the way the game was playing out. We, we, it wasn't like Dundee United where um, where we didn't have enough of the ball. We had plenty of the ball. We had enough chances. Enough territory. We created enough. We got into enough good areas. A couple of decisions I'd like to see back again. I don't want to overly speak about decisions because uh, it doesn't. Want, I don't want to start making excuses. It can't be like that. But. We had enough of the game, we got in enough scenarios um, to, to do better, to do better, to come away with, as I said, at least a point. So we need to learn for it quickly, quickly. We've got another two t- very tough games we need to prepare as best we can for and, and be ready for. What did you say to the boys at the end of that game? Because it looked as if everyone was a wee bit disheartened come the end. Yeah, they should be. They absolutely should be, and they are. Um, we all are. Um, it's a game we prepared well for. We were fully ready for. Um, we wanted to come here and win the game. That was that was the plan. We understand that's difficult. It's a very good team we're playing against, but um, the way it played out, I still feel like that was that was achievable for sure. Um, like I say, just disappointing. I mean, I'll accept that it. it's no good enough to, to lose that game. I, you know, it's it's hurting me just now. Um, but like I said, we need to be. We need to be better than that in terms of the, the goals we can see just just sh- shouldn't happen and um, we need to improve from it. Thanks for your time, Stephen.